This video talks about the IDRAC-9 telemetry reference tool set from Dell, which is used for collecting the telemetry data from Parrot servers and integrate with the analytical and visualization solutions. This is a new improved reference tool set with a simplified and streamlined setup to make it faster and easier for execution. The data can be visualized in Grafana with automated dashboards by following three easy steps, cloning the repo, running the scripts, and clicking on the dashboards. The iTrack 9 telemetry reference tool set is a set of tools to enable the customers to collect the telemetry data from Paris servers and inject this data into the big databases like Prometheus, Elasticsearch, InfluxDB, and thereafter visualize this data using the visualization tools like Kibana, Grafana, or Splunk. The diagram here shows how the data from various iTracks is collected by the data collector present on the reference tool set and provided to the big databases and thereafter visualized using the visualization tools. We present this demo in three phases as data collection as phase one, the data storage as phase two, and the data visualization as phase three. The reference tool set is available at this kit location. The reference tool set architecture has applications with a plugin model. The message broker facilitates the communication between the applications. The various applications are listed under the command directory present at this kit location. The ingress telemetry reader application establishes the SSC connections on the configured iDRAGs and reads the stream of telemetry metrics. The ingest pump application will ingest these metrics into the big databases like ELK pump ingest the metrics into the Elasticsearch database, the Influx pump ingest the metrics into the Influx DB database, and the Prometheus pump exposes the metrics in the Prometheus endpoint. The config UI is a front-end user interface to configure the iTracks. The DB disk auth application is responsible for servicing all the requests to onboard the iDRAGs and write to the MySQL database. The simple disk and the simple auth applications have file-based source identification through config INI file. The prerequisites needed to set up these reference tool set are iDRAC needs to have a data center license and the firmware needs to be 4.0 or above. The OS can be either Windows or Linux. Ubuntu version 20.04.1 is used in this demo. The Docker and the Docker Compose needs to be installed. The Copper Compose version needed is 2.2 or above, and there needs to be the Docker containers to be run with the user rather than the root. A browser is needed on the Ubuntu box, which is used in this demo. Now let's start the demo. Let's check the Docker Compose version. It is 2.2.3. Now let's git clone the repo. CD to this iDRAC telemetry reference tools and find the list of files and directories under this folder. We have the Docker Compose YAML file and the Compose script. The Compose script can be used to start and stop the Docker containers to set up the time series databases like Elasticsearch, Prometheus, InfluxDB, or Splunk as shown by this help. Today, I will demonstrate how to use this Compose script to start and stop the required Docker services for the Influx and the Grafana pipeline and visualize the data with automated dashboards in Grafana with three simple steps. To do that, I'm going to use the 
setup option for the influx test db to create the authentication tokens for the influx and the grafana containers once the setup is complete we will use the start option start the influx and the grafana containers we will see that the required docker containers for setting up this reference tools for the influx and the grafana pipeline will be up and running shortly now let's check the state of the docker containers by docker ps minus a we will see that all the containers are up running at these ports now going to the url local host at port 8080 there is a telemetry service configuration page to add the idrax make sure the idrax have the metric reports enabled to stream the data see the references slide to use the scripts for enabling the metric reports now we will have a add new service or the upload csv op file option which can be used to add either one or multiple idrax i'm using the csv file upload option to upload a csv file with multiple idrac ips along with the credentials once the csv file is uploaded the streams from idracs will be all set to be used for data storage and the visualization sample of the csv file is available at the git repo location of the reference tools in another browser going to the url local host at port 3000 log in to the grafana ui page if the default credentials are not changed it will be prompted to reference tool set provides a automated dashboards list which could be used to visualize the data browsing to the dashboards we see few examples of the dashboards showing the fan rpm reading dashboard and the power metrics dashboard now clicking on the dashboard fan rpm reading we see that the data from the various servers is plotted against the time scale we can go to the other dashboard like the power readings which will show the power metrics been plotted against the time scale we can see the system input power or the total cpu power or the total fan power been plotted against the time scale for various idracs we configured now going to the other dashboard we provided like fan rpm hexagon view we can see that the same fan rpm reading metric is plotted against the time scale with a different view which is the hexagon view we can see that this data is been plotted for last 15 minutes when the systems were configured and if we leave the system for a longer period of time we can see a good graph for all of these dashboards for example once i leave the system aside to see for a longer period we can see the dashboards which will look like you which will show the fan rpm reading in the hexagon view and which is showing a threshold to identify the fan rpm reading of the particular server is going beyond the threshold and which will show an indication to do the data analytics on that server to prompt any irregularities with the fan rpm reading or the fans of the server
This is how we can visualize the dashboards using the automated dashboards being provided with these reference tools. We encourage the users to make their own customized dashboards based on these examples. The data in the dashboards can be visualized for a range of time period, like 15 minutes or three hours, or even bigger amount of time for the past year. Going back to the slide deck, we have the Git repo location being shown in this slide. And then we have the references provided from Dell, like the reference tool set documentation being provided at this link and the white papers under the Dell support side showing the, both the telemetry streaming and the telemetry data visualization at the following links. We do provide a 30 day trial license of the data center. We also provide the link of the scripts which can be used for enabling the metric reports. Any queries to the development team can be emailed to idrectelemetryteam at dell.com. Thank you for watching this video.